Ever since Breaking Bad first aired, RVs have suddenly become a kind of chic thing. Often seen as a bit cramped and unpleasant, people are designing all manner of unique RVs these days that break the mold of what you might think they have to be, and none more so than these. These are the 20 most luxurious RVs in the world. Number 20. Self-Driving Audi Big Rig You might be surprised to hear that this motorhome costs more than your house, but it can be true depending on whether this truck gets built or not. In fact, I'm not even sure if you can call this a motorhome, but it's a unique thing, so we'll just get it out of the way. Back in 2016, Artem Smirnov and digital modeler Vladimir Pachinko decided to come up with two variations on an electric big rig that could be made by Audi. This was before the big electric car boom, so Audi was indeed thinking ahead to see what might be better best for them in the future. Equally as unique was that one of the vehicles was going to be autonomous, you know, as in it could drive itself, so that would be a true innovation had it actually come to life. Notice how I said that though, had it come to life. Both of the concepts were rendered and shown in different driving forms so that they could be pictured in different scenarios, but they were actually never made. One of the reasons might have been that electric car aspect of it. As noted before, this was before the boom that was caused by Tesla, who who finally made the electric car feasible, and also, autonomous driving had never been fully accomplished, let alone by something like a big rig. So Audi would have needed to go full tilt on that concept in order to make it what it was promised. The rides do look sleek though, and having electric big rigs on the road is something that Tesla and others are currently working on, so we'll all just have to see if the concept is something that comes ahead of its time and move on. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. Volkner Mobile this one is actually a motorhome, I promise. In fact, the Volkner Mobile is known for their luxury motorhome builds, and if you don't believe me, well, you'll see it in the Performance S model that they've made. This is a $2.4 million motorhome that you can get, and if you were to get it, you wouldn't only be able to fit your family and luggage into it, you'd actually be able to fit your car as well. Specifically, the Performance S model was built to house a Bugatti, so you can house your supercar in your super motorhome. Doesn't that just sound lovely? And that only scratches the surface of what the Performance S model can do. A slide out wall adds even more space when the vehicle is stationary, which is something that every family is going to want as they're camping out in their new special home. Add to that, there are solar panels on the roof and 1800 amp hours of total battery capacity, ensuring that no matter where you are in the world, you'll have battery power. Something that many of you would appreciate, I'm sure. Going back to car storage for a bit, it is a cool thing that it can do, the under vehicle garage emerges hydraulically and the owner drives a car onto the platform and then it slides underneath. There's no need to tie the car down or even lock it into place. Once you're on the platform, you're good. Seems suspect to me though. You might be asking, but why would you need to bring a car to a camping trip out in the middle of nowhere? Well, just think of it in the practical sense. What happens if you're camping and you suddenly need something? Would you want to drive your big old honking RV all the way into town for a gallon of milk? Or just get your car out out of the bottom of it and use that to go to the store. Number 18. Featherlight Vantar Platinum Plus. Now, if you're wondering just how far some people will go to have a luxury motorhome that's perfect for every need, there are variations of the land yacht, as they're known, that can reach up to $7 million. The Featherlight Vantar Platinum Plus is one that can reach that high at times, and even at its base of over a million dollars. So, given all of that, this ride must be a super luxurious one, right? Well, indeed it is. For example, when you're living in this motorhome, your kitchen is going to feel like you're in an actual house house. The farmhouse style sink is one of a kind and hand painted by Marcy Studios and it's surrounded by custom copper countertops. The Platinum Plus also features a built-in coffee center and a stainless steel dishwasher, high full cabinets with copper fused glass, pull-out pantry, utility cabinet with vacuum, sub-zero refrigerator freezer, and an onyx dining table. So yeah, you're basically going to have a full-on kitchen and dining room within the motorhome. Plus, you'll have a master bedroom, 
your own private bathroom, and a menagerie of other things that will make your land yacht stand out from the crowd. Oh, and what a crowd you must be in to have one of these things. It also should be noted that for all of its luxury, it's not meant to house that many people. In fact, even for all of its opulence, it's only meant to handle two people and the driver. So for all of that space, they made it so that it can be enjoyed by the smallest amount of people possible. You know, that's how rich people work and all. Oh, and like the last one, you can apparently put a car inside of this motorhome, so it's all still very fancy then. Number 17. Prevost H345 ESS up next, we have a motorhome in the form of the Prevost H345 ESS. It's definitely going to make your eyes bulge as you hear about what it has to offer and just how luxurious it is. It's honestly in the range of stupid luxury. For example, in just one motorhome, there are five televisions. Yes, five. How is it possible, and why do you even need it? Well, not all of them are small, if that's what you're thinking. One of them is a curved 55 inch, and the others are 24 inches that you can lower down, apparently, and one of them's even in the shower. That's right, you're living in such luxury here that you can actually watch your favorite television program in the shower. Just to make yourself extra cozy, you'll be accompanied by the 18 inch Amante fireplace for a welcoming ambiance, and even a mural digital art display, giving you access to over 10,000 works of art from museums and galleries from around the globe. And why would you need all of this in a motorhome? I don't even know. However, it is a luxury thing, so clearly somebody wants it. I'll quickly get to the bathroom, because apparently this thing has a heated toilet and the ability to play music in the bathroom via Bluetooth. The perks of being rich, right? And the list just goes on and on from there, which includes a master bedroom, heated floors, and a lot of other things things to make you forget how you're not in the wilderness. You're just in the Prevost H345 ESS. So how much does it cost to get this lap of luxury? Well, about $1.8 million. Given the people who would want to live such a place, I'm not surprised that they would be up for paying that much. Number 16. For Travel IH45 Luxury Motor Coach. Now we're going back over 10 years to talk about this next one, but when you make a quality ride, time isn't really that much of a factor. Four Travel designers began with a clean slate when developing the new Four Travel IH series. They incorporated the knowledge that was amassed from almost 45 years of coach building in order to make the best possible ride, which I can appreciate because every vehicle maker should lean on their experience in order to deliver the best ride possible. With a full load of fuel, that's up to 200 gallons, a full load of fresh water, and an estimated 500 pounds of cargo, you'll be able to put quite a lot into the 4Travel IH45 luxury motor coach and proceed on your journey without stopping. Now, to be fair, the motor coach only gets about 6.6 .6 miles to the gallon, so you'll definitely need a whole lot of money to fill it back up. But what about its features, right? Well, how about a home theater speaker system, a Blu-ray high-definition DVD player, and an in-motion satellite system with two HD receivers that come standard. It also includes a patio entertainment center with its own HD receiver, and in the galley, standard appointments include a two-burner electric glass cooktop, a microwave oven, and a 120-volt residential refrigerator with an indoor ice and water maker. So yeah, it's everything you're going to need for your major road trip, and sure, this is an older model of vehicle, but considering all that they were able to put into them back then, it just goes to show how creative they were. And as for its asking price, it can run you up to $2 million and obviously will cost much more to maintain over time, so just make sure you can afford it before you get it. Number 15. Cami Terra Wind Focusing now on the name of this motorhome, Cami Terra Wind, what do you think the special feature of this ride is? Is it the fastest motorhome in the world because of the wind in its title? Is it one that can go over any surface because of the Terra in its name? Well, you'd be wrong twice. The answer is that the Cami Terra Wind has the ability to ride out on the water. The Terra Wind is the brainchild of inventor and amphibious vehicles enthusiast John Gilgem and his wife Julie, who are founders of the company Cool Amphibious Manufacturers International. Believe it or not, they were former jet ski tour guides who then got the idea to put a motorhome vehicle out on the water.
Bleep or not, they made it happen. And power comes from a Caterpillar 3126E turbocharged 330 horsepower diesel engine with a power takeoff unit. You have automatic transmission for driving and a marine gearbox for operations in the water. It gets its propellers in motion, and then it's easy enough to shift from land driving to water driving so you don't have to be all super technical to make it work. You simply just put one in drive and the other in neutral. Now, naturally, you might be worried about it sinking or toppling over when it's out on the water, but fear not. It's built with a very low center of gravity, so there's no risk of it toppling over. With the addition of the pontoons, it's supposed to handle four-foot waves and winds of up to 40 miles per hour, and granted, they do tell you not to take it out in the toughest of storms, but if the weather permits, you could ride this thing out like a boat. Oh, and it's only going to cost you a measly $1.2 million at its peak, and, uh, you know, chump change for most of us. Number 14. Newmar King Air We'll begin by listing out some features of the new Marking Air, because there are a lot of them. Amongst other things, it has heated and cooled front seats with power lumbar, recline, footrest, and a queen-sized passenger seat. Power comfort leather sofa with opposing trifold sleeper sofa with memory foam mattress. Power extendable flex booth dinette. All electric appliances, such as an induction cooktop, convection microwave, dishwasher, French door refrigerator with internal ice maker, and super polished quartz countertops with a farmhouse sink, porcelain tile floors, midship half bath, and so much more. I mean, I could have filled up this entire entry just with stuff that it has, versus the stuff that it doesn't. And unlike the other rides that I've shown you, the new Mark King Air actually has its own security system. It should also be said that this is the 2022 model of the motorhome, so you can expect the latest innovations both inside and out to enjoy. And make no mistake, people have enjoyed this brand of motorhome in the past. In fact, I can tell you that a certain former president even rode around in one of these motorhomes for a while, so that just goes to show you how luxurious they can be if they can house a world leader. They are expensive though, as you'll end up paying an upwards of one and a half million dollars just to ride around in the thing. Number 13. Monaco Signature 44M Moving on, we have the Monaco Signature 44M. It's a long motorhome that offers a lot within it. Like what, you may ask? Well, it has a Freightliner Ultra Steer. It's 43 feet and 9 inches long. It has a spacious living area with a king-size bed. Optional equipment could include the beautiful custom body paint exterior, a king auto-locating satellite, a second roof mount patio awning, a lithium battery upgrade, a Wi-Fi extender, a cell phone booster, a solar panel, an upgraded radio system, System and something called a mobile eye. And if that's not enough, well, it also has a full tiled out shower, generating 10 kilowatts of power with a window awning package, color changing under chassis lighting, full bay slide out cargo tray, diesel aqua hot upgraded Firefly multiplex system with 10 inch Vega touchscreen, and much more, whatever any of that means. Well, are you content with all that? You can take a look at the pictures of the interior of the RV and you'll see why you should be. The place looks pretty comfortable and I'd be more than happy to relax in that right now. I mean, seriously, just look at those seats. Those alone are calling my name because I could use a really good nap. All the yawning aside, it is impressive that it has this amount of features and the upgrades that you can get for it, and you can see why many would want it and drive around in it. And of course, the people who own this kind of motorhome are also those who just have about one and a half million dollars to throw around, so you can make out of that what you will. Number 12. Serve Commander 4x4 Looking at the last several motorhomes might have made you feel really small but it also might have shown you that even the most luxurious motorhomes are meant for basic travel and not really traversing mighty landscapes. If you prefer a ride that's going to take you off-road and into more remote places, the Serve Commander 4x4 is your kind of vehicle, because this motorhome has the bandwidth to tackle some of the more tough places of the world, as well as letting you live comfortably inside. The motorhome boasts a three-point torsion-free chassis, which allows the vehicle to twist in response to bumpy terrain. Based on a man truck, the Commander 4x4 wears military-grade Michelin tires that provide optimal traction in mud and sand. And in other words, if you do need to go off-road to get yourself somewhere, this ride can absolutely do it, and will do it in style. 
Plus, you can pick different variations to suit your needs. Buyers can choose a standard two-seat cab, a four-seat crew cab, or even a sleeper cab with a bed where the back seat would be. Equipped for long adventures, this RV can hold up to 500 to 1,000 liters of water and even has its own filtration system, along with a solar panel array and more. As for its interior, you can customize that to your liking. You'll have options for wood, marble, steel, and so on. So while the Surf Commander 4x4 may appear to be a bit more rugged than the others you've seen, if you have about $500,000 laying around, it's going to be a fun and luxurious way to go off-roading. Number 11. Integra Coach Cornerstone 45 Next up, I have the Integra Coach Cornerstone 45, and it's another RV that's got a lot going on, and the team behind it are more than happy to brag about it. They say that a few of its impressive standards include collision avoidance system with collision warning, an adaptive cruise control and electronic stability control system, equalizer hydraulic automatic coach leveling, Winnegard Wi-Fi extenders with 4G and LTE, a 12,500 watt diesel generator with automatic start, on-powered slide out tray, aqua hot, and a whole bunch of other fancy things that just go on and on and on and on and are much more than would ever be in your house. So yeah, it's all a mouthful, but it does add up to an experience that's going to allow you to go across the countryside in style and live out the dream of being in a nice place while also out in the wilderness or wherever you decide to take it. The good news is that this RV is less than a million dollars, surprisingly, so if you do get the right version of it, it can be yours. Number 10. The Winnebago Horizon the 2020 Winnebago Horizon is a bold step in a modern European-styled refinement that's complemented with seamless performance capabilities. Or at least that's what the team that's behind it would like you to believe and would say about it. You can be the judge for yourself. There are two variations of this ride, each of which offers a luxurious master bedroom and interior spread that'll satisfy those with elegant tastes. Equally as important, the Winnebago Horizon has a myriad of places to put everything you brought with you. So you don't need to worry about not having enough space because this one has plenty of it to stash whatever it is you need to bring with you. A big bonus is that despite all of its features and luxuries and whatnots, it comes to a price that's not even $400,000 to own. So that's a really big win for those of you who are budget conscious. Number 9. Tiffin Allegro Bay Super C Motorhome the Tiffin Allegro Bay Super C motorhome had the first front engine diesel chassis designed and built exclusively for the RV market. That means that it allows those within it to have a luxurious and spacious experience while also knowing that they're going to drive smoothly wherever they go. Under the hood, it features a big old honkin' Cummins diesel engine that produces 360 horsepower and 800 foot-pounds of torque, allowing the Allegro Bay to tow up to 12,000 pounds. So if you do need to attach something to it, by all means means, feel free. Other onboard amenities include two air conditioning units, a Truma AquaGo Comfort instant hot water heater, a washer and dryer combo, and an 8 kilowatt Onan diesel generator to provide power while boondocking. Certain models of the Tiffin Allegro Bay Super C motorhome cost less than $200,000, making it a viable option for many of you out there. Number 8. Stefix Motorhome. Each STX motorhome is developed, tested, and built with fluid lines, exceptional curves, attractive design, and, in other words, embodies audacity. They also plug the Nordic lifestyle that the ride embodies, so if that's your thing, then you're likely going to want to get one of these rides. From the leather, carbon, and precious wood interiors to the ultra-modern living spaces, to experience an STX is to experience the essence of luxury RV living. Or so they say. Again, that's really something you can judge for yourself. Looking at some of the pictures though, you can see why they're so high on themselves. They come in some unique shapes and can be customized in terms of the paint jobs, and some of them can even fit a car in the back. Oh, and if you're interested, you can get one of these for only about $250,000 at its base. Number 7. The Maverick Venali's MV12 
The creator of the Maverick Vinales MV12 is very high on the concept of working with you to try and give you the ultimate motorhome experience. They offer personalized solutions in each project and every vehicle is customized right down to the most tiny of details according to your preferences and they only offer the best quality with top class materials. While that all may sound a bit much, it's actually the kind of thing that you may actually want in your motorhome because a lot of the time, and with many of the rides that you've seen so far, you can have some customization, but most models are simply built the same way. Here though, things can be exactly how you want them, no matter how small the detail may be. And for $2.7 million, you better believe they're going to make those little touches come to life. Number 6. Truck Surf Hotel and you thought the last aquatic vehicle that I talked about was weird, but don't worry, this one's pretty odd as well. The Truck Surf Hotel is a two-story, five-room, bed-and-breakfast hotel built onto a Mercedes Actros truck chassis, which serves the surfing community by following the waves from beach to beach amongst the coasts of Portugal and Morocco on a weekly cycle. While not your typical motorhome, Daniela Carnero and Eduardo Ribeiro were able to use the truck chassis to make it so that more people could enjoy the surfing life without having to live too far away from the beach. And you do have to admit that it's a clever thing and shows that necessity is the mother of invention once again. It's hard to know just how much it costs to make this hotel, but the experience is no doubt priceless. Number 5. Concord Centurion the Centurion is the flagship model of the Concorde brand. This huge truck from Germany can successfully compete with the most fancy of camping buses of American manufacturers, and I honestly don't doubt that as European models are known for their quality and luxury. There's an abundance of space in this vehicle, which is why it fits, amongst other things, 12 rechargeable batteries for you to drive on, and it's a very green vehicle indeed. The interior is basically like a studio apartment, but with little nooks and crannies to help fill up the space when you need, including a drop-down bed from the ceiling. In addition, the car is equipped with a system of 16 cameras, and thanks to all of those, the driver can observe everything that's happening around the vehicle on several screens. So how much does it cost? Well, only about $750,000, if not more, depending on the upgrades that you get. Number 4. Anderson Mobile Homes the Anderson Mobile Home deserves a special entry on this list for a very simple reason. They completely customize each vehicle to fit the need of its owner. In this case, those owners are more times than not celebrities, and as we all know, celebrities can be very picky with what they want and need when they go camping, because they go camping all the time, right? Their first build was the studio, which Will Smith saw and fell in love with. He had it customized and it became the Heat, a monster two-story, 22-wheel motorhome that can still put to shame actual mansions. Now seriously, I could spend a long while just talking about what Will Smith had put into his movie trailer, which includes multiple levels, a viewing area, and more. But if you're wondering what he spent to make it happen, well, that's about two and a half million dollars. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that he was fine after making that purchase. Number 3. Element Palazzo Superior the Element Palazzo Superior is the top-of-the-line model that's been recognized in over 190 countries as one of the most luxurious and, without a doubt, the most outstanding motorhome to date. And to the credit of the manufacturer, they did make an especially nice one. That's because it has one feature that all the other ones that I've shown you does not. It has a sky lounge, and it's one of the true highlights of the Element Palazzo Superior. It's extraordinary and exclusively reserved for the owner's outstanding panoramic views, its automatic lift system raises it up out of the body, and that creates a walled-in roof deck. It does sound kind of nice, doesn't it? And it doesn't even touch the other elements like the luxury interior or any of the other facets that will make you feel at home. And that's a home that you'll only get if you're willing to pay over $3 million for it. Number 2. Newell Coach P50 How's this for a twist as we head to the end of the video? The Newell Coach P50 isn't just another RV, it's an RV that was made in collaboration with Porsche. Yes, that Porsche. Meaning that you'll be guaranteed luxury and design skill because the car maker wouldn't settle for anything else. There is a dinette, a kitchen, a bedroom, a living area with three beds in the recreational vehicle. Plus, like some of the other ones that I've shown you, the P50 is a custom designed and custom engineered vehicle for the customer. So you'll get to 
outfit it and design it however you want in order to ensure that you get the ride that you feel you deserve. How nice. But it's only going to be nice if you have about $2 million to shell out for it. Number 1. The Furian Elysium RV now I've shown you a wide range of RVs throughout this video, but this next one is confirmed as being the most expensive that I'll show you today. There was one that was like $7 million, but that was just a range and not its base cost. As for the Furian Elysium RV, it's a $3.49 million ride that has a lot of unique features, not the least of which is that it's one that has a freaking helipad. Yep, you can land a small helicopter on this RV, which is beyond bonkers for all kinds of reasons, but hey, when when you're stinking rich, why not show off how rich, right? Obviously, the rest of the RV is equally as nice, and it includes all of that lavish and opulent stuff that you'd come to expect and would happily fawn over. And then once you're done, you can just jump in your helicopter and fly away. Whee! That's all from the realm of RVs and how grand they can be. Are you surprised by some of the styles and features that these luxury RVs have? And do you even give a rip? Which one of these would you personally feel is the best of the lot? And are they all just a little bit out of control? Be sure to let me know all about it in the comments section down below. Check out the other cool things that are showing up on the screen, and I'll see you next time.